heard this is a tough interview. Is it? A grilling? I'm not sure if we're coming in or not. Well, it's just going to be tough. Is it? Yeah. Are you finally okay? Jack, you good? Yeah. Yeah, good. So obviously the start of the season has been great, but when you came here, did you imagine the opening the season the team's had? I hoped it would be positive. I think you always, um, I think you always have belief in the way you work, and I knew I was coming to a fantastic club as well. So I think in my own head that I always wanted it to be a good start and believed it would be. So you spent three years managing in Scotland. So how hard was it adapt to the English style of play? It's a good question. I think that there's, there's, there's bits that are the same. So when you manage or you coach, and there's core aspects of it that stay the same regardless of what country or what league you're working in. And then there's bits that are unique, or not unique or different. So even one of the big things for me is, um, geographically, in Scotland obviously it's a lot smaller country. So your travelling distances between games are a lot smaller. So that's different. Obviously, we spend a lot more time travelling, particularly where we are in the northeast. And then the number of games. So there's 46 league games, and then cup games on top of that. Whereas last year I was in a 36 game league season plus some cup games. So that can limit the amount of time sometimes you're on the training pitch with players because they've got recovery. For example, this week when we go Shrewsbury, Doncaster, um, South End. So that's been different. It's been adapting to that, but a lot of things you know similar, and, and you know I'm enjoying it as well. So. What? What were your emotions when you saw the vast amount of supporters coming out to see the team in the opening game of the season against Charlton? Yeah, um, as a manager, I never really think about too much from my own point of view until probably after the loss when you reflect on it a little bit. Um, but that occasion, that first game of the season, is something that you know whatever happens in the rest of my career, managerial career, that I'll look back on with a lot of enjoyment. I think that I'm privileged to be the manager of Sunderland. I think it's an unbelievably good football club with an outstanding fan base and I've looked at it as being an honour to do it. So when I stood on the edge of the technical area before that game and seen the size of the crowd and the level of support we had in it, it's a privilege to do it. And then that noise when we when Josh equalised and Lyndon scored the winner will, will remain with me as well. And there's been other occasions like that, both home and away, but um, if you love football, like I'm sure you do and I do, then it's fantastic to be part of that. Yep. Are you friendly? Yep. Brilliant. Best questions I've had today. <laughs> you can tell Nick and all the guys next door that it's far more interesting than the questions you just asked me.